Yo, what's going on, guys? Today, we'll be going for my sixth top one global tournament finish. We have Hog Earthquake. Why does this guy have Inferno Dragon? I just faced him a couple matches ago and he had Goblin Drill. He might have sniped us. This could be bad. I'll pop the ability. Why does he have Zappies with the Inferno Dragon deck? I think he sniped us. He was playing Goblin Drill spam. No, does he have Lava Hound? Otherwise, why would he have Phoenix and Inferno Dragon? A Hog Rider with this, try to get some early damage and see what he's running. Bro, why does he have Tornado? He definitely sniped us. What the? Okay, well, we probably just lost. We could try to do something though, but he even has Zappies for our Mighty Monor, so I don't really know what we can do. They yeah, it's Lava Hand. We just have to go in Mighty Monor Goblins. Hopefully do something. Oh, he messed up. I think it still will reset the Mighty Monor, though. Okay, that's actually pretty good damage. I'll Musketeer low. Oh, he has Balloon. I'll just Mortar. I think we're kind of dead, though. We can't stop this. Man, I wish they made the Global Tournament matchmaking a bit better. Because currently you can only face people who are within one win of you. Okay, gonna Mighty Monitor ability. I mean, pretty good defense. That could have been a lot worse, but it's probably still pretty much over. He even has Tornado. <laughs> Why did this man have to do me like this? Why, Why Tornado? At least Lava Hound without Tornado, we could still do something against. We can Goblins with this. I know he's gonna try to Tornado, but he can't Tornado and kill the Goblins. Okay, smart Goblins by us. We can just Mortar. See what he wants to do against it. Okay, I think he will lose his tower, but he's going to definitely take ours. We can't really defend. Almost get here early. We have to try to cycle multiple. There's no way to defend, though. We probably will lose our tower either way. Just don't want to get three crowned. We can hog rider like this. Try to force out something, maybe. Gonna mighty monitor to hopefully protect our musketeer. Okay. We can musketeer again. Gonna pop the Mighty Monitor ability. We can also just use our three card cycle to go kind of crazy. I'm surprised this man is making it this close, but now we're kind of in trouble. Uh, I'll Musketeer again. Wait, Hog Rider is gonna do a lot of damage. Wait, there's no way this guy loses this. You play Lava Loon with Monitor, with Zappies for the Mighty Monitor, and Tornado. And you somehow lose. We can Mighty Monitor here, then try to get the ability right on the tower. He may be in trouble. <laughs> he might be in trouble. <laughs> he might be in trouble. He kind of messed up the Zappies too. No way. Gonna Musketeer. <laughs> this man always BMs me as well, so. Yeah, I don't feel bad for him. We can just hog rider gonna also mighty monitor try to get the ability on the tower. How do you lose this man? What a guy. This man deserves an award for somehow losing this. He messed up the minor. <laughs> Good game. We got a match. I know this guy. I'll go for the hog rider first play. Wait. Wait, he normally runs splash yard. Did he snipe us? A mortar. See what he has. We can pre mighty monitor to predict something. Oh, he has earthquake. Might be a hog earthquake mirror matchup. He does have queen though. He will have to ability. Or not. <laughs> I'll take it though. I'm not sure how to feel about this. Mortar is one cheaper than Inferno Tower, but the Inferno Tower will always counter the hog earthquake, and Mortar won't since it doesn't shoot back. We can Hog Rider. I'm gonna pre Earthquake for the Inferno Tower. Also, I feel like the Queen might get him more value than the Musketeer will get us, so I'm not sure how to feel about this. I'm not sure if he's trying to snipe someone else or us. I'm gonna Mighty Monitor in the back, try to just put him in an awkward spot. That's what Mighty Monitor in the back usually does, since you can always switch lanes with it and everything. It has so much HP too. I'll go for the Musketeer in the back. 
Mighty Miner will get a nerf pretty soon in the next set of balance changes most likely, but I think it'll still be pretty broken. Most likely. We can hog rather, we definitely outcycled him. Oh he has miner. Wait, he's definitely trying to snipe someone, but I don't know if he meant to snipe us. I'll go for the goblins in the middle. Because I think this will be a decent matchup for us. What does he even have for the mortar now? Valkyrie. I don't really want to. I don't really want to waste the musketeer up high. We can just ice tiny. Gonna go for the hog to kite. He will have to inferno tower. At least it's always a plus one trade every time. We are in a pretty good spot so far. I don't think he tried to snipe us because we don't have a good matchup, but. I think it's beatable. Gonna musketeer the back. He can't really kill it without any big spell. Only earthquake. Okay, I'll just go in for the hall router. Wait, he has poison and earthquake. I don't know who he's trying to snipe. <laughs> oh, he forgot to use the queen ability again. Let's go. Gonna musketeer. Nice hog hit. Definitely want to go opposite lane in this matchup since he has poison. Gonna hog router to pull this back. Mortar this side. Oh, he messed it up. <laughs> okay, we can definitely outcycle him now. He's gonna have to probably earthquake. Yeah, so we can just hog rider. And he has nothing. <laughs> nothing good. Oh, let's go. Two hits? Three hits? Let's go. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, we just have to be safe. Gonna earthquake the queen. We can just pretty much spell cycle. He's going to probably start spell cycling too. He has so many spells in his deck, but I don't think he can do enough. We can pop the Mighty Monitor ability. And then uh, Queen should die here to the log. We can Goblins. I think we just need two more Earthquakes. I'll Earthquake the Valkyrie. Guys, guys, guys. We're getting so close to number one. I currently have five top one global tournament finishes. And Muhammad Light has six. He got one more very recently. So if we get top one, we'll tie it up again. Good game. All right. I'll go in for the Ice of the Tiny variety. One of my favorite varieties ever. He has Balloon. I'll go for the Mortar. It should fully counter it. Ooh, he may have Lumberloon Freeze, seeing the bar, bro. This will be pretty difficult. We only have Musketeer for air defense. I'll play the Hog Rider all the way in the back. Try to make him leak a few elixir before he can play his tornado. Should be at least one hit here against the bowler. We can log it away too. Try to get two hits maybe. Or force out the NATO. Oh, no King Tower activation. You kind of have to cycle your Musketeer in this matchup. Even though it's your only air defense, you can't really defend anything without it. Also, we will have to try to abuse our Mighty Monitor. That's our one good card here. I'll go for the Mortar on offense. I just feel like being aggressive, we kind of have to to win this. If we play the slow game, we're kind of dead either way. Nice Goblin's prediction. We can Mighty Monitor too. I'll pop the ability. He still will have to respond to the Mighty Monitor for sure. Uh, we can Musketeer. Might take a lot of damage. I'll try to Ice Tiny. Please, no hit. Okay. He has no tornado now. Okay, I want to go for the hog rider at four. Okay, I think we got it in front. Should be a dead inferno dragon. You know what? Really good start. Really good start. I'll take it. Gonna goblins. He has no cheap way to stop it. He's gonna have to overcommit for sure. Or ignore them. Solid damage, though. We have to take out his full tower. It's going to be so hard to get any shape. We can just mortar. If they defend well later on in the match, you pretty much can't get any damage. I'll ignore the bar, bro. It should be pretty much tower down either way. At this point, he's pretty much in earthquake cycle range. We just have to try to defend. Oh, no. I don't know if we can defend this. Uh, oh, no. We need another, we need another uh, musketeer. Have to mortar up high. Oh, the bowler is not dead. Oh no. 
We have to goblin surround log this back. Oh no. Okay, okay. Our tower is alive. He has no tornado for offense now, at least. We can mighty mana protect our musketeer a bit longer. Put him in a bad spot. I'm musketeer again. Gonna ice tiny. It should get some good damage on the sea response. Uh, pretty bad balloon. We can just mortar up high. I think we're okay. Honestly, freezes. We might have to do something. I don't know. I don't think so, though. We'll see what he does here. Oh, he's already back to the NATO. Okay, gonna goblins. We have to go full focus mode. Gonna musketeer. Oh, he might go in. Okay, I don't think he has the elixir. Ah. Uh, just gonna mortar up high. He may try to freeze. I don't know if we can stop it if he freezes. Gonna hog rider. Okay. He's keeping up with us pretty well. Gonna musketeer again. Go in for the ice tiny. Try to force out something. Wait, I think he messed up. I think he messed up. We can just log this back and then try to start the spell cycle here in a second. Just gonna goblins. Hog rider like this. Musketeer. If this doesn't get a hit, I'll probably just start spell cycling him. Okay. He has no freezing cycle, at least. We can ice tiny again. I'm kind of scared to spell cycle, man. Okay, we can do it. We can do it. We have our musketeer blocking, too. He's going to have to tornado for our hog rider. We can mighty monitor early. Block the breach. Let's go. Good game. This guy again. If we win, we'll finish top one. If he wins, he'll finish top one. We do have 3.0 expo. There's way too many people trying to snipe me. Hopefully he's playing Splash Shard like he was before, but he does switch sometimes to that modern deck we faced earlier and stuff. I'll just go for the Knight. He's playing pretty slowly. I think he has Graveyard, but he might have made some substitution. We can just go in for the Expo, see if he has something crazy like Earthquake. Hopefully not. Gonna Archers. Log this back. Might be some damage. Wait, he might have messed up. Uh, a little bit of chip damage. I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay, so I feel like this matchup is pretty solid for us, but he's the best Splash Yard player in the world, and I haven't played Expo for a very long time until right now. I'll go for the Expo. Bro, the Google just interrupted me. My Google Home. Okay, Archers, come on. My Google Home Mini was just talking, and it scared me. Okay, Expo's going to town. Oh my. Okay. Okay, I don't want to get too ahead of myself, though. The thing is, it's so easy in single and double elixir usually in this matchup, but in triple elixir, they just go crazy with the graveyard spam. And it's hard to defend, even with Archers and stuff. Okay, I don't want to go in the same lane as him though. We can just expo this side. We have to go opposite lane, otherwise he's going to get free poisons. Uh, not the best archers, but it's okay, I guess. We can knight bridge block in case he tries to graveyard. Yeah, I'll east sprint in case he's skelly king abilities. Perfect. We're already back to our archers. He could poison if he wants to, but that might be a bit of an overcommit. Okay, I'll go in for the expo. Uh, knight. I have hard to kill the phoenix. We can archers again. We can't really break through without the archers, but then we kind of have a hard time on defense. Oh no. Uh, gonna e spirit. Hopefully, get a good connection. No, 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 no. No. No, we might actually lose now. This is kind of bad, because I don't want to go same lane as him. We have to go opposite lane still. We can Tesla up high, just try to scare him, and then we can expo this side. Gonna pre-knight. Uh, I'll lug this back. Might be something. Never mind. Barbara is so good against expo, that's the one thing that's saving him. 
I'll go for a high Tesla again, just try to have some bridge control. We can expo again, the Tesla might kill this Phoenix here by him, so that will be good. How do we break through though? Knight, uh, archer's low. I know he's gonna bar, bro. Okay, fireball. Wait, he might have messed up. Okay, we can log this back. I expose on tower. Archers? Oh, he messed up. He messed up. That was a bad graveyard. Okay. It is still kind of close, though. We still have to keep up the pressure. We can Tesla up high, just set up for another offense. Can't really go into the Phoenix, though. Just have to wait a second. Gonna fireball the tombstone. We can archers. Interesting graveyard on the left side. Gonna log this away. Another expo. We can Tesla up high, just kill the Phoenix before it even crosses. Really good fireball value, too. I'll let the expo die. We don't need to over defend it too much. Guys, I think we just got number one with 3.0 expo. Okay, Tesla again. So. Okay, wait, we, we have to defend. Log, log, log. Okay, okay. I think we got it. He has no, no, he can't get that much damage. We can knight just to be safe. Log this away. Guys, we have officially tied it up with Muhammad Light. Good game. Not happening, pal. So we're officially tied with Muhammad Light. Six top one global tournament finishes. We just need one more to break the record. Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.